you know, it's just a great experience for people to have together. And you're around a bunch of people who may not think exactly alike, but have similar interests. And you're just out here spending, you know, a couple of summer nights uh, having sex, doing drugs, listening to music, and all those fun things that people like to do. And um, dressing up as pink bunnies. Yeah, you know, and. Uh, <laughs> Everybody who's watched the movie Woodstock, you know, wishes the dream of that sort of happening on the summer when you were young and you were looking for that experience. I hope this kind of thing can happen in America. Instead of it just being these isolated festivals like Bonnaroo, that it really could happen in, you know, a hundred cities every summer like, like the festivals do in Europe. Our crowd really wants a big variety of music. It's just everybody thinks it's all about sort of, you know, fish and the Grateful Dead and it's some and that in some sense it would be exclusive or you know, it would it would push away bands like us. But I'm starting to realize that it's really just the other way around, that people want there to be a variety of bands who kind of, you know, embrace, you know, new music, you know, old type of music and just any that that is just sort of music. I mean it doesn't really matter to me. It's their night. It's not my night. And I just look at it like I'm just another thing that you can walk over there. I've got some big balloons. I've got some blood all pouring my head. If you like that, come see it, you know. And if it's if it's not your thing, it doesn't matter to me, you know. I mean, they already love music and really all music is great. I mean, there's not one kind of music is better or more interesting than the other. If you like it and it moves you, uh, you know. So I don't know. I'm I'm really just here as to help out. If you guys need someone to help clean out the toilets, hey, I'll help. I don't care. You know, I'm just here to help the festival do whatever it is that it's trying to do. Don't let the promoters know that. They might well, I sure. <laughs> well, I mean, I just sort of feel like it's. I'm not here to. It's not my agenda tonight. It's the audience, and it's really we're here to we're here to make it their night. I think most artists, if they're being totally honest, will will tell you that the fear of creativity is that it's just, a lot of it is really just a, a lucky sort of cosmic accident. That yes, indeed, we're trying to do something and we want something to happen, but a lot of times you're in there playing and really nothing great does happen and you sort of play around with the same ideas over and over. But if you're lucky, um, something comes along and you go, wow, that's, that's, that's great, let's do that, as opposed to this boring thing that we were trying to do. And um, we go in that direction. And so, I don't know, I don't really know what the mystery or the magic or any of that really is. I mean, I know it does work and I know it does happen. But um, for the most part, you know, ideas and art and all that sort of stuff, you know, it, it, it doesn't work. Even though it's my music, you hear it and you think, oh, I hear myself in there. If I knew how to do that, Jason, I'd tell you. <laughs> I, know it, I know it happens, and I know people do it all the time, but I don't really know how it happens. I, know it, I, I just know there's some, there's some luck. Through some luck, it hopefully will keep happening, and maybe it will happen to us, and you know, people will still think that we're interesting. To be in a band is really, it, it really encompasses all the great exaggerated elements that is art. I mean, you can, you can look any way you want, you know, that's kind of a statement. You can sing about anything you want. You can sound any way you want. And, uh, you know, that's a powerful thing, you know. Um, now you can make videos, you know, uh, you can make your own movies. Um, you know, it really encompasses just about everything there is in the arts, and you can sit there and say, this is me, using all these different things. And so I think that's why I was drawn to rock and roll to begin with, because I really come at this whole thing as just being a guy who loves music. I'm not really a musician or anything. I, I don't know if that's, if that's good news or bad news, to tell you the truth, but I think um, people like watching a guy trying to do something. Now whether that's climbing a mountain or trying to get to the moon or just trying to express himself. You know, I, for some reason people admire that and I'm glad that I pick something that I can really get enthused about. So I don't know, but I think all art is great. I mean certainly I'm in a band and uh, it looks like I mean, it's about music, but I love movies, I love novels, I love 
painting, I love cooking, I love all that stuff that requires any element of that thing that, that says it's art, um, I think is great.